Clinical trials are happening across the Bay Area as doctors look for ways to treat those who are positive for COVID-19. Ada on your side's Megan Gannon spoke with one of the doctors involved with the national trial about the treatments they're currently studying. The clinical research trial has been happening here in Tampa for several months. Another research group down in Bradenton just recently started this trial. All of them trying to figure out how to treat COVID-19. Almost a year and a half into the pandemic, more clinical research is one of more than 240 locations around the country taking part in the National Institute of Health's research study. What we're looking at are ways to reduce symptoms, ways to reduce the viral load and spread and to prevent uh, hospitalizations. Dr. George Monlux says part of this research is looking at monoclonal antibodies and how it can treat COVID, including the new variants. We have two different monoclonal antibodies that are very effective uh, against the these variant strains. He says the treatments they are studying are administered two different ways. One is going to be an infusion and the other, so that's like a, getting an IV. And the other one's gonna be an injection. But they are needing more people to participate to get a better understanding of how they can treat symptoms. So we're looking for something that can help with the symptoms of being really fatigued, miserable, and help that group of people. So that's about 80% of the people who are, are infected. Now, Dr. Monlux tells me they will be a part of this clinical research study for at least the next year. And for all the details and how you can participate in it, we have those posted on our WFLA website. Reporting in the Tampa Newsroom, Megan Gannon, 8 on your side.